Hey everybody, this is Paragon522 with my 7th tutorial. And you can see I am not on Thlackrass. I'm on GM Fires Construct V3. Simplified. Uh, the original version has custom textures and uh, custom models on it. So basically I just took those out and made it simplified. So, yeah, it's completely different from the old version. Blah, blah, blah. More stuff you don't really care about. Just get on with the tutorial, right? Okay. Uh, so, today, I'm going to show you all how to make a count... Or, not a countdown. A missile that auto-tracks player... Oh, auto-tracks melons using expression 2 and how to make an auto missile using expression 1 that tracks players or models using a target finder and I'm only doing the tra target melons with the expression 2 because I had to make my own target finder because the old one was pretty slow and so yeah alright uh, let's start off with the basic um, missile Uh, you can do two things here. You could use an AMRAM missile. Like, you use this model, you copy, and then you go to explosive simple manual model. Put that in. Excuse me. Model. Bam. So then you have the model. It's got an explosive model, so like, if you have a trigger of explode, then when it activates, and that thing will explode, blah, blah, blah. Okay, but I don't really feel like making that. So... I mean, like, I don't feel like dealing with, like, moving all around it back and forth. So I'm going to make a miniature little tracker, I suppose. So I'm going to use robotics. Just a little A2. If you don't have these, then you need to go update your PHX SVN. Uh, I don't think Gary'sMod.org has the right stuff on this. Okay, so like before, we're going to have a vector thruster. Uh, force multiplier 10,000, force minimum 0, force maximum 10,000. Bidirectional checked, because we don't want it to go one way and not go backwards if somebody's behind them. Collision, I'd have that off. Enable sound, if you want that on and you were a minge bag or whatever, blah blah blah. You know, sounds are for minge bags, etc. Uh, I'm going to have that off. Works for out of water, works underwater, so that way you can go underwater at people. XYZ world, use yaw, yeah, don't use that. Okay. So put the vector thruster on there. Click twice. I'm probably going to split this up into three parts because there's a lot of cover. Okay. So GPS. And put that right in the back. Right in the center. Okay. Now if y'all still have this expression from like... If y'all still have that missile expression from way back then then this is good for you. But if you don't, then you're going to have to remake it. And I look, and it looks like I'm going to have to remake this too. I'll pause the video and come back to you when, when I get this remade because it's really sloppy and probably way messed up. Uh, okay, guys, I'm back. And I have my expression right here. It's all written, simple... I just didn't feel like going through two minutes of writing everything and explaining everything over, so I'm just going to repaste the, ex the missile expression onto the description. Okay, so now, since we have this, we got a lot of inputs and outputs now, so now we're going to need a target finder. Uh, I'm not going to make it target props anyways. Uh, target players... 
I'm not going to make it target players, but you might want to make it target players or some stuff or something. Do not target owner. Chill's not going to check, target me anyway, so I'll take that on. Okay. So let's just go ahead and place our target finder. Let's get a beacon sensor. Output distance, output world position. Okay, so we'll just put that right there. It doesn't really matter as long as it's not using bearing. Okay, so it has no target right now. Target, okay. Okay, so uh, we're also going to need a numpad because of how I have it set up. It's going to be numpad controlled. I'll place that right on the bottom. So let's go ahead and get your wire tool out. Wire. No, let's just. Yeah. Okay. BX goes to the beacon sensor, world X. BY, beacon sensor, world Y. BC, beacon sensor, world Z. GX goes to the GPS, world output X. GZ or GY because alpha Y and GZ goes to alpha Z. Now our disk is going to be to our beacon sensor distance, and as long as the beacon sensor is in the front, you're going to be fine. Okay, uh, target, we're going to wire that to the target finder, output 1. Num is going to go to the numpad. Okay, now we're going to get our vector thruster. Hit multiply. Multiply goes to output multiply. X goes to put X. Y goes to output Y. And Z goes to output C. The time for weight changes. Wait to allow it. If you don't have this, go download it. Alphagarismod.org. Okay, beacon sensors and everything, but the vector thruster is going to be zero. 0. 0.001. Oh, and the missile itself. The vector thruster, we're going to make that weight 20. Actually, it depends on the thruster you're going to use in the back. If you don't understand that, let me show you real quick. I'm going to move that back. Go to wire, thruster. I'm gonna use this plastic bucket because it's like strongest for the sm how small it is. And place that right there. Wire A to our output thrust, which I s simply made multiply that by that. Okay, now since this thruster in the back Weighs 20. I'm going to make the front the front here weigh 20, so that way you have balance. Now I'm going to make the middle weigh 40. Now this thing still doesn't have a target, so I'm going to put melon copy wire target finder prop filter. Pot, paste some melon in there, target props, now you see it has a target, it's targeting the melon, I'll put that way out there, turn it on, bam. Now this would be better if you attach an explosive to the front. I normally do, but I didn't have time to explain. Okay, so this is part one of the missile tutorial. Oh, also, if you're gonna make this thing fly, I suggest making some of this stuff no collided with everything. That way it just doesn't get stuck. That kind of stuff. Okay, tune in for part two if you want to learn how to do this in expression two, which I'm gonna make my own target finder make my own GPS, and make my own missile expression. Okay, 
Have fun. Don't burn yourself.